Hi, this is Mohammed Shakil here. Here I'm going to show you how you can use the stiffener command in the Katia V5, the part design workbench. So, for creating the stiffener, what I'm going to do, I'm going to create a sketch so that I can create a stiffener. So, basically, I'm doing a general sketch over here, which would need a stiffener. So, I'm coming out, I'm going to give some 30 or 40 or 50. I'm do the mirror extend. So, so if I need a stiffener right here, like this, so I'll select this particular plane. I'll give the sketch. What I'm gonna do? The stiffener sketches should be touching both of the boundaries. So what I'll do? I'll just project these two sides and select and project it to 3D and I'm going to trim this so that these ends would be these both of the ends would be lying on this particular surface so once that is done you can select these edges and press delete come out of the sketch and select the stiffener command over here so right here you can give whatever thickness you need like uh, you know 10 or something and you can click OK so basically one question will be coming to the viewers mind then why we can't use the pad command instead of the stiffener so in this particular case yes you can use the pad command but there are cases uh, I'll show you for example there are cases where you cannot use the padding and you will have to use a stiffener so I'm gonna delete the stiffener I'm gonna create such kind of situation where you exactly need the stiffener I want to select this and give the sketch. I'm going to get a, create a circle over here. I'm coming out of the sketch, giving a padding. Okay, so this is done. So if you create a profile over here, and if you do the padding, I'll just show you. If you use the padding command, what will happen? So I'm going to select this, this, and I want to project it to 3D. Select this, and mm, I'll select this like this coincidence like this and coming out of the sketch and do a padding of around uh, 10 and mirror both the extents see what happens over here this doesn't get filled and this is where you use a stiff stiffener command so I'm selecting the sketch once again so I'm going to remove all these things and coming out of the sketch and use the stiffener command so you give the exact 10 which you have given before 20 and click OK and see what stiffener does it completely fills the remaining parts so this is how you can use a stiffener so the thing that you have to remember while using the stiffener is this end points so as you can see in the sketch this point should be lying and it should be closing this particular surface where you need the stiffener so that's the only thing which you need to remember and you will be good to go with the stiffener so I hope you enjoyed my video and try this out thank you